So I have this love-hate relationship with glam decor. Look at this. Dust. <laughs> Just dusty. All this dust. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and clean this up and get this area together for the fall. East Coast always in me, Commonwealth, Lil Joe, getting love from my city. Yeah. I roll call for the DMV. In my own lane, you could still ride with me. Yeah. Okay, loves, let's talk about how I have, I'm getting tight tongue. <laughs> let's talk about how I have my bookshelves and my TV console styled for pre slash early fall. Let's start with this bookshelf on this end. The bookshelves themselves came from CB2. And what I done and what I like to tell my followers and subscribers is that a lot of these stores you can register for their coupons and you can register for their emails and when you register for their emails you'll get coupons you know so when I purchased these bookshelves they were I think they were $2.99 each so now they're like 300 and something. And I did get 20% off when I purchased mine. Now, if you're interested in these, they also come in gold and black. The gold is beautiful. But I'm more of a chrome girl, so I ordered the silver. I don't have anything against gold, but my go-to color is silver. So you can go on the CB2 website and register for their coupon. But if you do order, be sure to use my link below so that I can get credit for you ordering the bookshelves. 
Now, um, so the bookshelves themselves are anchored to the wall, just in case you go out and order them unaware that they're anchored to the wall. So they're anchored to the wall. There's screws back there, here, and then there's another screw here and here, and then there's a two more at the bottom. Because when I ordered them, I knew they were anchored to the wall, but I didn't know exactly how. And I'm glad that they're anchored to the wall. So that saves me from changing the bookshelves around and putting holes in my walls unnecessarily. So this is a good thing for me. So bookshelves from CB2, link below. The vase on top came from at home. The ceramic books came from Z Gallery. You can order them online. And most of the time, the regular price for them are $19.99. That's the last time I checked. But sometimes they're on sale for 14 bucks. These beautiful pumpkins here, I've had them for a few years. I haven't seen them in a couple of years. These came from Home Goods. My go-to color is teal, and this is the color that I'm having in my family room for the fall season, for the entire fall season. I'm not gonna change it until Christmas. And uh, these candles here actually came from Home Goods. This super cute tray here came from, well, it just came from Joanne's Fabric. I purchased it last fall. It's actually a mirror. This is a mirror. It's not actually, I'm not using it for the purpose that it was made for. This is a mirror and you can hang it on your wall. You can see the little clip there that you can hang from wall. But I bought two of these because I knew that I was going to use this as a tray, which is how I have it set up in this case and it's super cute look at it it's so pretty and so these boxes here actually came from z gallery i've had them for a couple of years as well the vase at the bottom and the mirror mirror the photo frame also from z gallery the wall art over here came from kirkland's it was a set of two these florals here came from hobby lobby i think you can get your hands on these right now in different colors they have them in orange, white, red, burgundy, uh, pink, many, many colors. So when you see yours, just grab them up. This vase here came from Home Goods. I purchased it for spring and I'm using it throughout. My console came from Wayfair. I'm gonna place a link below. These are Dollar Tree candles here, not candles. These are Dollar Tree pumpkins. They have these every year in this color. The Hello Fall candles here came from Home Goods. I pretty much used all the candle, and I'm planning on adding me some more candle in here. But I love this jar, and I'm not going to get rid of them. So, going to hang on to that. This um, decor piece here came from Home Goods. You saw me pull this white one out and stick a teal one in there. These teal pumpkins also came from Home Goods. And this tray here came from QVC. Um, if I can find the link, I'll place it below. And these candle holders here are from Bath and Body Works. I think you can get your hands on those as well. So whatever I did to that bookshelf, I also do to my other bookshelf. I like keeping things uniform when it comes to my bookshelves, I don't know. I just like having the same thing on each shelf. It's really just that easy for me and it looks nice and clean when I do it that way. So what's going on with my fireplace? That's my video. I recorded that. Either I recorded this one or the one in my master bedroom so that when I'm doing my videos, I can have something nice playing on my TV screen. I didn't want to play anyone else's video because you know that could potentially lead to a copyright violation. So it's a good idea, especially for you uh, home decor influencers with the YouTube channels, is to go ahead and record your own screensaver. So when you're recording your videos, you can have your own video playing and you don't have to worry about any copyright violations because I have this. I have one set up for Christmas and I am loving. And then one good thing about these screensavers is other people use your screensavers as well. 
So that's what I have going on on this side of my family room. I do plan on doing another video decorating the other side of my family room, but for the sake of having videos, I'm just doing it bit by bit. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.